The latest masterpiece of Great Wall Motors is the new ORA, short for open, reliable and alternative, under the banner of women's cars. However, ORA was identified as a pink tax, and the high price and low-level configuration caused dissatisfaction among female customers. In June, ORA's total sales volume was 11,500, a year-on-year -year increase of only 6.7%. During the same period, the sales volume of new energy vehicles increased by 1.2 times year-on-year. -year. The low sales volume is a market feedback for the lack of product power. The transformation of traditional automobiles into new energy sources will always seem out of place in the initial stage. Under the general trend of new energy, both Volkswagen and Toyota are deploying new energy transformation in order to seize the opportunity in the next race. In the transformation of traditional automobiles into new energy sources, BYD is the most radical and the most successful. BYD has become a leader in the field of new energy vehicles since it announced that it would stop producing fuel vehicles. According to public data, from March to June this year, BYD's sales exceeded 100,000 vehicles for four consecutive months. In the first half of the year, BYD's cumulative sales were 641,400 units, a year-on-year -year increase of 314.9%. In comparison, the cumulative sales volume of Great Wall Motors' new energy vehicles in 2021 is only 137,000. Compared with BYD, Great Wall Motors lacks a clear direction in the transformation of new energy, and lacks eye-catching products, making it difficult to occupy more market share. With more and more traditional car factories entering the new energy track, Great Wall Motors' competitiveness has also been questioned. As China's first representative of the complete transformation of fuel vehicles to new energy, GWM did not copy BYD legend, but gradually fell behind in this competition. At this stage, the core products of GWM are still mainly fuel vehicles. Why is this? Why did the GWM lose to BYD? Your vision is your world. Hi, everyone. Welcome to Auto Age, now you are on the journey to look back at every change in the car, witness every surge in speed, and explore the mystery behind the car. Before we started today's video, please subscribe to the channel and turn on the notification bell. Ok, let's get started. In the first half of this year, the top 7 global new energy passenger car sales, BYD is the first, Tesla second, SAIC third, Volkswagen fourth, Hyundai Kia fifth, Geely Volvo sixth, Renault Nissan seventh. The new energy vehicle pattern has been initially determined, but Great Wall Motor has still not found a suitable direction for itself. Data shows that in June, Great Wall's new energy vehicle sales were 12,700 units, with a total penetration rate of 12.5%. Under the premise that the new energy transformation is not successful, Great Wall Motor sales of fuel vehicles are also not satisfactory. In the first half of this year, Great Wall Motor's retail sales were 380,893 units, down 17.5% year-on-year. The Evergreen Havel brand of it has accumulated sales of 288,903 units, down 26% year-on-year. Besides, the Harvard H6 was surpassed by BYD Song and Model Y, losing its dominant position in the SUV market. The GWM pickups represented by the Great Wall Cannon recorded a cumulative sales volume of 94,417 units in the first half of this year, down 20% year-on-year. The new energy trend is unstoppable, which has greatly affected the original status of fuel vehicles, which is also the reason for the decline in sales of the Havel brand. Moreover, new energy vehicle brands are all eyeing the SUV market, 
and the decline in Havel sales is likely just the beginning. The same decline in sales is also the brand WEY, which represents the high-end dream of GWM. In the first half of 2022, the cumulative sales volume was 21,985 units, of which 2,887 units were sold in June, down 38.7% year-on-year. Intelligence and electrification are important opportunities for automobile companies to catch up. The profit of high-end models should not be underestimated. Tesla's gross profit margin has already exceeded 30%, which is actually a powerful manifestation. However, the decline in WEY's sales made Great Wall Motors lose the high-end opportunity in the next new energy vehicle battle. Moreover, it also makes the profit growth rate of Great Wall Motors not as fast as the revenue. According to the 2021 annual report, the company's operating income in 2021 was 136.405 billion yuan, a year-on-year -year increase of 32.04%, the net profit attributable to shareholders of the listed company was 6.726 billion yuan, a year-on-year -year increase of 25.43%. In a word, GWM's fuel vehicles are subject to the general trend of new energy, and its new energy vehicles lack competitiveness. Well, the decline in sales is just the beginning. Along with Great Wall Motor sales, it was the stock price. After the stock price hit the highest point of 69.8 on October 26, 2021, Great Wall Motors fell all the way. At present, the stock price has halved to about 32 yuan, a drop of nearly 50%, and the market value has evaporated by more than 400 billion yuan. However, the growing pressure of market competition in the automotive industry will lead to stronger technology entry, higher capital thresholds, and greater market concentration. In fact, even if the general trend of new energy vehicles is set, the overall market size of automobiles will not be n times larger than it is now. In other words, new energy vehicles did not create new demand, but squeezed the original fuel vehicle market. In other words, the large-scale popularization of new energy must be a double blow to the price and cost of fuel vehicles of the same level. The layout of the new energy vehicle field is late, and the first-mover advantage is lost. The high-end products are weak, the dependence on a single model is serious, and these problems posing an obstacle to the continuous development of Great Wall Motors. So. How does the Great Wall respond to this unprecedented crisis? At present, Great Wall Motors is seeking to make a breakthrough in overseas markets. In 2021, Great Wall Motors' overseas sales volume reached 142,700 units, a year-on-year -year increase of 103.7%, accounting for 11.1% of sales, from January to June this year. Great Wall Motors overseas sales reached 62,823 units, accounting for 12% of sales. In 2021, Great Wall Motor once made such an ambitious goal. By 2025, the revenue will exceed 600 billion yuan, and the sales volume will exceed 4 million, of which 80% are new energy vehicles. However, data show that in June, Great Wall Motors sales of new energy vehicles were only 12,700 units, with a total penetration rate of 12.5%. The development of Great Wall Motors in the field of new energy has been too slow, and it seems that there is still a long way to achieve this grand goal. As for the glory of Great Wall Motors in the era of fuel vehicles, I am not sure if it can continue. Okay. That's all for today. Please put your comments below and share your insightful ideas with other people. Do you want to learn about more auto stories? Please keep following our channel and like our videos. Thank you so much for your continuous support.
Your precious time with us is highly appreciated. See you.